access to Trapper's Cabin. This route is not maintained or signed. It is strenuous and potentially hazardous. The hike to the cabin is about two hours one way. Elevation, half a kilometer. Good morning. Oh, your hair in my mouth. Good morning. We are up very early because we have to be at Malibu Rapids for, I think it's 11.30 because that's slack tide. You really have to time that one. So we are pulling up anchor and getting motors going at 7 a.m. this morning out of Green Bay. And it's four hours up and then we'll be good, hopefully. But um, yeah, what a gorgeous morning waking up here. Check it out. Even Maggie's like, wow. Thing we have to do is release the stern line. Releasing tension right now. Stern line is off the tree, just pulling it in. Lane's heading back to the boat. Okay, well that went way smoother than yesterday and now we're just heading up to start bringing up the anchor. It's cool. Look at those eagles, eh? They're eating something in the tree. Right, right by the water. Pass on the right. 
Ugh, some of these people up here just drive me frustrated when they don't know how to operate boats properly. Because then you can't even guess what they're doing. Just pass on the side of the boat that has no more room. Yeah, he actually squished between us and land. Like, what an idiot. And I tried to get them to come around the other side, but no. Ugh. Anyways, sorry, that's my rant. If you're gonna drive, follow the boat rules, and drive properly. I'm not sure what this little dude is doing. We're a big boat coming in. Supposedly there are stern rings on rocks over here. So I'm gonna go look to see if I can find a stern ring that we can put the stern line to before we start attempting this maneuver. Just looking for rings. There. What do you want me to do? Uh, I'm just hanging the tender. I'll uh, drop. I have got drop the anchor. Okay, I'm here. Woohoo! Hold on. He's turning too. I am way up in the trees. We actually decided to do a bit different. We put the stern line out first this time. Let's grab my bow line. My bow line. So, I don't lose my so what's cool about Princess Louisa is we actually anchor stern line to shore over here because we kind of lose the sun around four or five o'clock, which is really nice because the whole boat cools off in time for sleep. And let me show you, you can see how the sun is actually chasing, or the shade is chasing the sun up the mountain. Watch this. Okay, so shaded, sun, look at it. The shade is chasing the sun up the mountain. And you wanna know why we have shade? Well, look, little boat right there or a fairly sized, good sized boat, probably 40, going up. Massive granite cliffs. Isn't that cool? And tomorrow, we're actually gonna climb those things. Not the granite cliffs. I think we're gonna take a trail over on that side. But yeah, can't wait. So we had an issue last night, yesterday, with the line being not heavy enough test. So we're taking it all off and we're going big time now. Okay, so Izzy is, <laughs> keep going. Oh, I'm catching a fish. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm not a fish. I will pull all your line out. This actually works better. Oh, give me five. <laughs> Woo, drop four. And it's gonna be blue. Red. <laughs> Ah. So, we are going to video us being nice and um, fresh right now. Yeah. Are you ready for this? So, five minutes up the hill, we'll get another video of us being completely <laughs> destroyed. Hazardous Blaine. We got this. Oh, we're hitting the muck already. What? We're hitting the muck already. We're hitting the muck. Hey, caution, this route is very challenging. Potentially hazardous, very steep. Trail surface is uneven and slippery. The route is not marked or patrolled. BC Parks does not recommend the use of this route. So are now there, that their liability is covered. Are there two routes? Or? Oh, rest in peace, Adrian Management. Oh, no, Riparian, not rest in peace. <laughs> I thought this said rest in peace, Arian Management. I'm like, that's weird. No, Riparian Management. shedding clothing. The heart rate is up. The 
dog is leading the way. <laughs> I'm being very cinematic, Blaine. Dramatic. This dangerous and hazardous trail. Might need a push. Ready? One, two, three, up! Ah! <laughs> Cameras don't show justice. Okay, I've got the camera straight in front right now. We're going up. What? Oh, river. We got muck. Oh, sorry. I almost wiped. Not just the humans that need water. Nope. Do you have a lid for that? No, I'm just gonna drink it. <laughs> and drink it. <laughs> Ew. Hanway's water. Did you want to drink it? No, I'm good. What do you think so far? Good. Good trip so far. Beautiful. Good trail. Beautiful trail. Beautiful. Ow. I just walked my head. I'm a log. It's a good log. Maybe I should want a helmet. It's a good <sighs> we have a flat area. Give us a break before we go up. This is beautiful. Oh, look at this stream. Hi, Janice, you're way down there. Come on up. This is, this is like roots, hands, and knees. Yes, it is. But it's beautiful. Okay. Okay, I found a log to sit on and rest for a second. Blaine took off, of course. He's like up there. But I need to just. Yeah, Blaine and I aren't in the best of shape, but we can do this trail for anybody that wants to. It's kind of cool, but uh, you definitely need to rest. And slow down the breathing. Hear my heart rate going down. Yeah, he just took off. Wait for me. Stopping. Ugh. That was it. Right there. What do you think so far? It's steep. It's a lot of steep. It's cool though. Oh, it's an awesome trail. Like, you can see already what the view is going to be like once we get up to the top. Yeah, I got to control my breathing though. Yeah, I've been trying to deep breaths. I slow mine down. Yeah. But it is a stunning trail. But you definitely have to take breaks. Some people may not have to. We definitely have to take breaks. Yeah. Again, we are just the average 50 and 45 year old climbing a mountain. <laughs> I just looked up. It is friggin' straight up right now. I see a tree that's hit by lightning. Whoever flagged the trail, thank you. He got the first bug bite. So now it's time to get the off on. Get our off on. Ah, it's cold. Oh, you have a bit of a cut there. Oh, it stings the cut. Up. Lots of good handholds. There is. I am climbing them. Maybe we should have like climbing gear. <laughs> <sighs> I 
How was that? Let's keep going. And you can see the waterfall in there. There's a couple. It's beautiful. Check out that spider's web. That's beautiful. This is my this is my philosophy going up here. If Krista can do it, I can do it. She'll think that's hilarious. Where are you? Oh, you go under logs, around rocks. Ooh. Maggie's having a blast. Megs. Maggie's hey. having a blast. She says, I like these rocks. Things going up. Up, up and away. I'm just gonna rest for a second, just like this. That's like hugging a tree. Plane's up there. I think I'm dead. Gosh, that's a bit of a, yeah. Okay, just gotta figure out where to put my feet. Woohoo, falling. There. Come on up. Well, I kind of had to lean across to the tree yes. and walk up the crevices. The tree split. Oh, maybe you're past where I was walking the crevices. I came up on this side. Ah, uh, just uh, walk. You have to go under the tree right there. Yes. Wow. Yeah, like that. I'm a bit worried about where this trail is going because there is like sheer cliffs up there. Look, sheer cliffs up there. Sheer cliffs in front of us. And our trail's going that way. Okay, let me show you how sheer these are. It's straight up, like up, like up. The camera doesn't do it justice. How far up that is. There's what? There's a bed frame right there. And look at the log. The log just the log cabin. Do you think this is it? I think this is it. Totally it. Oh, it's like a But look at that. Oh, wow, Blaine. Wow! Okay, this is... We made it to the trapper's cabin, not to the top. It's beautiful. The waterfalls is right behind us. And now we need snacks. We have to replenish the body. Right, Blaine? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see your back. <laughs> so we were gonna attempt to fly the drone over by the waterfall, but Blaine said no. Too much wind. Too much wind. And there's a lot of canopy here. So this is going to be interesting. We may lose another drone. You want to launch it off the log? No. Just water. make sure you start the recording right away. Yeah. <laughs> I have told you that none of our drones are brand new, right? We get them really secondhand. So we're not doing this like really to wreck brand new drones. 
Um, but I think it'd be a really cool shot for you guys. Look at what we do for you guys. It's crazy. I would go bathe in the waterfall too, but Blaine said no. To turn the camera that way, record going up to us. <laughs> We have a drone way up there. Blaine's just gonna put it up through the canopy, spin it, and then bring it back. So what happened? It just, it was all over the place. And it wouldn't go up any further. Trapper's cabin was cool. Mosquitoes are bad. Drone flight unsuccessful. Drone flight unsuccessful. So now we're heading back. Right, Blaine? Yep, it's that time. What do you think, Blaine? Are we are we ready to go down? What do you think? Is it worth it? Absolutely. It's quite the hike, but absolutely stunning. Plus, I get to watch my husband's butt all the way up. Hey, he's got a cute little bum. I was hoping I could swim in the waterfall, but Blaine would say no. Okay, down we go. Going down is going to be slower. I think. I don't know. Slower, but. Definitely not going to be fast. No. At least I hope not. Going down fast. Um... <laughs> Bad. Ugh. Where are you going, Maggie? We gotta go. Daddy's down there. Hey. Come on. I know. I'm right here. Good girl. Go down. Come on. Come on, Maggie. Hey, Max. You smell something. Maggie. Well, yeah, because that's always entertaining. I don't even know how to do it. Carefully plan your steps. Oh, the tree. Yeah, the tree is oh. quite, oh, Janice. I got a look, <laughs> I got a root. I'm good. Are you okay? Sure. Can I laugh? <laughs> I caught a root. I just did a little, did you see that? That was a little. Just a detour. Now what? Just a slight detour. Well, either you can try to go out and around over here, or... I think I've got my other leg now. No, it doesn't look too bad. Not as bad as the one leg. Maggie is worried about you. I think I'm going to go here. Yeah. And then I'm going to crouch down. And slide, because you're already muddy. <laughs> <laughs> I think this was the worst section right there. Oh crap, my leg. Nice. It'll match your other scratch there. Okay. Another slippery spot. I recommend going down backwards. Uh, over this part. I think I'm going to go down over there. Look at them, they're so cute. They're little baby pine cones. They're very cute. What do you think about downhill with this big cliff? Downhill like is that. much, much, much better. Much better? Yeah. So my toes are jamming into the front of my shoes, but I've only had one little bit of a roll. No, but at least we're not, uh, not Huffing puffing. and puffing. Puffing the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> but this is stunning. It is. Like it's, it's so really good. hard to describe. I don't I'd know if the camera's- recommend this for anybody. It's, I don't know if the camera's gonna amazing. capture it. I love this moss, how thick it is, like... Okay, you think it's soft. It's not that soft, but it's very cool. I'm laughing, I'm going to Blaine, I'm like, we haven't seen anybody yet. And he's like... What'd you say? We're the only nutters out today. We're the only nutters out today doing this trail. Yeah, sometimes when you find a log, you just need to take a break. You just gotta sit. Yeah. It's all good. It's just your toes jam up in your shoes. And they start to hurt a little bit. But it's stunning. Like, just wow. In case you're wondering about my slip and slide, that's not bad. I don't think it's through the skin. I got a little bit through the skin there. And then that's from the rock gong show the other day. That one with the bruise. Not bad though. Yeah. Eh. Just a flesh wound. Just a flesh wound. We're all good. All right, okay.
Right there is a the tough part. I think you got longer legs than me. That's a good thing. Ooh, this is so pretty. This little battling brook blade. It's a little babbling brook. Oh, stretch. <laughs> this is a cool tree because look at it. It's the one that got struck by lightning. It's pretty wild. Yeah, we did. Oh. I think we're getting a bit mucky here. So socks get too tight. You gotta pull them out. Oh, they're wet. Can I quite see Tangaroa? Yeah. Say we're about halfway down. Yeah. There's some really big tall trees up here. Okay. Ooh, I think Blaine found people. Ooh, we're not alone. So this is really cool as, sorry, mosquitoes. As we're heading up, as we're coming down, they're heading up, but they are doing a documentary of the curve of time. So what's your name? Uh, I'm Annie. Aaron. Uhane. And Emery. Okay, so tell us what you guys are doing. Yeah, so basically we're following uh, The Curve of Time, which is a book written by Mira Wiley Blanchett, and she was a single mother um, to five kids and also a skipper that people don't really know about outside of British Columbia. So we are an all-female crew, and for the past six weeks we've been following her journey up and down the British Columbia coast, and Princess Louisa is one of the biggest parts of her book. So here are we you are. gonna go sliding naked down like she used to do with the kids while her clothes dried? <laughs> Maybe. I know what she was doing. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, it's so awesome. I can't wait for their documentary go to come out. I'm gonna have to give them a card so they can send it to us and so I can link it to all you guys. Okay, so what's the Instagram? How do we find you? Oh Cappy Movie. So C A P I movie. And awesome. That's it on Instagram. Mm -hmm. We don't have a website yet, but eventually we will. Yet mm -hmm. being the so, keyword there. Yeah, yeah. So the, the movie will just be called Cappy. Um, Cappy? It comes out. We're not really sure where it will be yet. <laughs> her kids used to call her Cappy, short for Captain. Yes. Yeah. So. Yes. So no. homage to her. That's awesome, guys. And we will video, I'll show you their boat. I'm going to, I can't show you it up here, but as soon as we get down, <laughs> I will edit it into the video and you can see their boat. It's really cool. We saw them come in yesterday. So, uh, yeah, so exciting. Anyways, have fun. Thank Should you. we tell Thank them you. how high it is up there? Oh God. Oh, let's, go. let's keep them. They, well, they, just, for, uh, they can have fun. I did it, Maggie. Okay. You catch me? <laughs> Just stay there for a second. Yeah. <sighs> Holy cow. Good job. <laughs> the trail goes this way. Yeah. <laughs> That's really baggy. Yeah, she's pulled it right out. <laughs> this is a problem once you're going downhill, if you trip. Your momentum, you're just going. Like I just tripped over that log and did this knee in. I just, I just didn't lift my leg high enough, so my back left foot caught on the log, and I just tumbled. Tea kettle. Oh, oh! Gee willikers! And my foot just caught right into there. That's scary. Oh crap. Okay. Whew. Conclusion, hike to the trapper's cabin. Is it worth it? Absolutely. Is it hard? Absolutely. But uh, yeah, we've had a few falls. We're really tired. Janice has had a few falls. Janice had a few falls. We're very tired and now it's time to go back to Tangroa and it is. have a swim. Have a swim, a shower. And a cider. A beer would be good. Yeah. I told Papa Mike to put on the radio every half hour and it is 126 now. Tangaroa, Tangaroa, Tangaroa. Well, there you are. 
It is definitely two hours up, two hours down. We're just coming up to the dock right now. Okay, we'll be in to get you in just a minute. Thank you. Okay. Welcome. Perfect. So I promised you guys to show you the boat that the girls are in. This is it here. It's a very cool boat. It is very cool. By all means. Out of Seattle. Yeah. That's cool. It's a little different than the Curve of Time boat, but it's very cool. But I just want to show you how beautiful this place is. Like, it is so hard to explain to people Princess Louisa and Chatterbox Falls. Oh, there's our ride coming. The boat's coming in. And there's our Uber. It's be cold. It is. Ready? Yep. One, two. <laughs> you can't see that. Okay. It's not very nice. Are you ready? Yeah. One. Yeah. Two. I'll go ahead and Three. That was the perfect way to end our hike, but now we need to hose off. Ugh. Okay, so where the heck were we? Look straight above the head of the dock there. That's oh like yeah. Down and then there's the big waterfall right I'm pretty sure that's where we were.